guys, it's Naki Rocks and welcome to another video. Today we'll be playing Live in the Back Alley Simulator and I'll be showing you all the ways how to earn money. Excuse me if I sound a bit different, but I'm sick at the moment, so that's my voice. Sounds a little bit weird. Alright, let's get to the first and most obvious reason how to earn money is by taking a trash. You have three areas you can pick trash. Here, there is the main area. For this area, you'll need a lead stick or any stick. This stick you can buy in this shop. And the more expensive stick, the more trash it can collect. Then, the second area where you can pick trash is called bridge area. For this, you'll need a bus ticket, which you can buy right here. And it lets you enter this area. If you're going to use stick, it's not going to work. For this area, you need to buy a shovel. You can buy shovel right here by the trash prospector. Again, the more expensive shovel, the more trash it can collect. So well, now you have the shovel and you can pick trash and earn a different type of trash that can earn you more money. Third area is called the hood area. To enter the hood area, you go again to the guy called Trash Prospector and you buy a hood pass. This is the third area where you can earn money by collecting trash. Again, if you're gonna use shovel, it's not gonna work. For this area, you'll have to buy a knife, which you can buy right here in the knife store. Once again, the more expensive knife you have, the more trash you can collect. And when you have your knife, you just go to any person and you collect trash for them. Or I would say you rob them. <laughs> so that's the first way how to earn money. And if you want to use fast transportation, you can go to this canal or whatever it is. And just press E and it travels you to the bridge. And if you want to sell all your trash you've collected, you can just go to this guy, press E and sell all. So that's how you earn money by collecting a trash. With each area, the trash is more expensive and the more money you make. Second way how to earn money is by cooking. If you want to make money by cooking, you'll have to go to this place, it's a restaurant. And you have to have microwave. If you want to get microwave, once again you'll have to go to this shop, Dollar General, and you need to find your microwave and buy it. You can buy it right here for $60. Then if you want to improve microwave speed, you can buy gadgets like this. But for now you just need to buy this microwave. When you bought the microwave, you'll go back to the restaurant right here and you have to pick a spot and place it. You have to use a spot where there's no microwave. So let's go here, press left click on your mouse and your microwave is in the place. Now you have to choose a recipe. So right now I've collected some paper. So let me use this cracker, put it in my microwave. As you can see, I'll have to wait 40 seconds, so let's wait. Alright, once the food is done, you left click, take the food, find a person that wants a cracker, left click on the person, give him the food, and you just earned your money. So that's how you earn money by cooking. Another way how to make money is by selling clothes. How to do that you might ask? Well, to be able to sell clothes, you need to have the hood pass. Then in the hood area, you'll have to find a laundromat. Once you fought the laundromat, you go inside, you'll have to buy a washer. It costs $350. Again, if you want to improve it with perks or gadgets, you can right here. Once you bought the washer, you select the rusty one or the ugly one left click it will become your washer again you'll select your recipe 
from the ingredients you have so let's say I want this bracelet use recipe it's same with the as a microwave just left click and you can see your clothes are in the making so now you just have to wait so let's wait all right once the product is done you take it out you have the bracelet you go to the shop that is right next to it which is here you'll go here and you sell your clothes to this guy and now you've earned money by selling clothes another way how to make money is by robbing a store for that you'll need a gun which you can buy again in the shop you buy the gun and now you have to go to the store you want to rob you'll have to be careful when you are crossing the street because the cars will kill you and once you die you won't have the gun again so let's go right now let's wait again and we're here the store you can drop is this one you'll go to this guy press E as an interact and you can steal you'll have to wait because not every time it works there's delay between all the robberies so you'll have to wait and once you can do it you just press interact and the money will go right to your account another way how to make money is by buying a lottery ticket in the previous days this was very very efficient way how to make money but now it has been fixed and I would say it's not really worth it we can try to buy few lottery tickets but now the chances are much smaller than before oh i won so i've actually made money because i had one nine now i have 2k so another way how to make money is by buying lottery tickets so these are all the ways how you can earn money and live in back alley simulator also a good thing to mention if you want to have bigger space you can just buy gadgets like this for example, I've already bought all of these items, so let me buy cassette tape and as you can see on the left side, my space is being higher and higher. Also, if you are someone who has the gold stick and you want to collect more than 10 trash, you can use this anvil and you will earn more and more trash with each upgrade. Also, if you have sock, you can place sock here. And Santa may bring you some money to your sock as well. This I'm not sure but I think this only works because of the Christmas season but you can use it for now so why not. Alright this was all the ways how to make money how to earn money in live in the back alley simulator. I hope I helped you a little bit. If you have any questions ask right away in the comments I'll try to help you in comments as well. If you've enjoyed this Leave a like, leave a subscribe, it helps me a lot. And as always, see you in another video. And for those who watched the video to the end, I have a gift for you. I'll show you how to get secret David badge. You have to go to the laundromat, get on these stairs and to jump right to this balcony and just go up from here to the top of the building just go by the stairs all right once you're here jump on the railing like this and onto the roof now you just jump across the building and here's the secret David David badge I already have it so I cannot collect it but but this is like a gift for you guys who watched the video to the end I'll appreciate anyone who's watching to the end so if you didn't know, now you know about this badge. <laughs> so once again, thank you for watching and see ya guys.